I'm a goddamn Touch me, yeah, yeah. Can't nobody touch me, yeah, yeah. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. It's time for us, man. We are 0 and 5 right now. Wait a second. Let me, let me go to myself. I know I put, did I put mine at 100 percent too? If I didn't, I got to do that too. Yeah, this is me, y'all. This is me. Right here. Real life height, 5'9". I weigh more, but I went with my high school. I was going based off of high school. So, high school, 220. I was not I was not a small kid by any means in high school. So, that's me. Yeah, now you see what I mean, Rex. Like, as in, because you're so tall, it's going to look weird, regardless. And because of your weight too, that that's going to be. That's why. That's why I made that cap of six. I made the cap of six five. You wanted six nine. I gave you what you want. Can't be. You can't be coming at me when I I I I I I I, I you know. Bended the rules to give what you want, and you're not satisfied with it. <laughs> but after this, I'm going four quarters only. Hi everybody, Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by KJ. Innovation that excites. The Bearcats have been mired in this deep funk and sometimes when things start going wrong, the harder you work, the worse it gets. At least it seems that way. They have to find a way to relax. I'm looking back right now, y'all, because stink bugs have been getting in my crib somehow. I'm getting tired of seeing them. But here we go. Here is me, my Cincinnati. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, wait. You see, I messed up so bad. Real Coke taste, zero calories. All right. I only play as myself. I don't play as anybody else. I don't play as QB. If they take me out, I just play as a lineman. All right. All right. And I always, always, always ask for coach opinion. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. There is me right there. I'm not a running back. I'm not a linebacker. I'm a silver back. Him down at about the 23 yard just smash mouth helmet to chin football by the defensive line there. They dominate. But I show you, you gonna see how my QB's dumb, bro. He be pissing me off. Look ah, he looks to me. Yes, let's go. There be cases when I do a play like that, I be butt booed, butt naked wide open. And he misses me. I'm trying to get us our first win. We we come so close and lose every time. All right. Here we go. Yeah. Dang, my 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 uh my my my, my, my lineman got in my way. 
about four yards away here on second down. Damn! At the 44. Also, my QB running too much. He, he 84 overall senior. I'm happy he got the lead. I'm open! Let's go. Bro, y'all see that? Y'all see that? Y'all see how butterball booty open I be? And I be hitting the X too. It's not like I don't call for it. And our deep and our old line's kind of trash too, bro. Push on that play. That's exactly why they were able to stop. That's that's why I'm that's why I'm giving this two seasons here. I'm giving like at least two seasons, cause we pro hopefully can get like a new set of people come in and change the game or like some uh. You know what? I'm on the I'm on the I'm on the hot route. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, y'all. Who was blocking him? Whether or not he comes after his offensive lineman and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. Now, who was blocking that man? Third and long here, and they hope to convert That man had a free first class ticket to tackle him, bro. High route, knee. Damn! No! Ah! He does a good job of reading the quarterback's eyes and is able to come up with the interception. I called for it, but I thought he was going to lob it up. Damn! I mean, skip the play. Hold on. As coach. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. Where am I? Where am I at? Ah! Hold on. I'm so confused because... Every time he drops back the pass. I play on defense too. Oh, let's go! Let's go! To the house! To the house! <laughs> Can I change the depth chart? There's no way to change the depth chart. That sucks. Oh, there it is. Oh, coach must have just took me out of that play then. Yeah, he just must have just took took me out. Let's go. First and ten. Ball on the 39 yard line. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. I hope so, KJ. We we need a better QB because he is buns. And he, when he be running too, he fumbles so much. He be scaring me when he runs. Dang! It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Oh, yeah. Give me good blocking. Give me good block right now. Give me good block right now. Damn! That's a great play by the defense. There's nothing Bro. Being able to slip off of a block, get into the backfield of the offense, and then make a play in the backfield to be able to create some momentum possibly for this defense. Scruggs is waiting for the snap. Plenty of hang time on this one. Signals for a fair catch. 
I love Cincinnati. I love the Bearcats. But, but, but college-wise football. Moving forward after a turnover is a perfect example of that. Let's go! All I gotta say is, if we win more games, do if we even win about three more games, if we win three games next season, I'ma stay because this team right here is hot boot cheeks. All right, hot boot cheeks. Maybe hopefully we can turn it around. Maybe we can turn it around. Uh, I have to look and see. Um. Like I said, it's based on the conference record, not your overall record. Cause you can have a, you can have a real bad, ah, you can have a real bad overall record. But if you win in your games in your conference, you're going to be higher in the rankings for the conference. I'm a, I'm a sim this cause I, I, I'm not doing a punt return. Um, okay. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Oh, let's go! Oh, look at them hands! Uh, I don't know how... See... You're looking at the you're looking at the college football rankings. Don't worry about that. That doesn't matter. What matters is your wins in the conference. That's what matters. You're looking at like overall college football. We're not doing that. We're not worried about that. It's about your com your conference records, which we'll get into. First down. Look at me, shifty. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's good for a gain of seven yards. So at the end of one quarter, no score here. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Tackle the left side after a nice pickup. Come on, baby. Come on, let's keep on chucking. Let's keep on chucking. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's a deep four. That makes it second and six. Please don't do nothing stupid. We came down here so far. It's always when we get this close to the end zone, the QB does something stupid. Bro, I was wide open through the middle! So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. Let me not get too hostile. We're right here. Third and two. Let's get this, guys. Let's go! First down! I'm not doing no damn speed option with the QB. He be have he bro. I f oh, come on, a spinning triangle. Got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. What to do, Jason? Uh, once again, like I said, I will get to it when it's time. All right, we will. <laughs> Rex, <laughs> Rex, focus on what's going on right now. We will get into that when it comes time. 
<laughs> oh man, I feel like I, I preach. I appreciate your voice and your concern, but sometimes you gotta focus on what's going on. Sometimes you you be missing that. You like when like when we be watching games about other games. You bring up Notre Dame and having no conversations, which is cool. I'm not saying don't do it, but it's like every match or like every so statement you worried about Notre Dame when it comes to like brother if I will get to your question I, I heard you I, I, I saw what you said <laughs> Louis Caesar sounds fire right now I haven't had that in so long damn I was not even controlling me. They not even give me. They. This team does the hurry up offense. That must be really the coach's game plan. Cause. Damn, who was, bro? Yeah, like I said, you you you're basically focusing on the wrong thing. Don't worry about that. We will get to that when it comes time. And also, you're five and one now. Damn. Gains his way to the 13 yard line. Bruh, they, bruh, they keep doing the hurry up offense on us and not giving us a chance to breathe. Ah, oh, left my. I, I was following the running back. No! Damn! Is this is 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 Houston, does Houston do this in real life? Maybe this is 2014. Bro, they are hurry up offense. They don't stop. And they come away with seven points. Well, so I guess that's hey realism for you. They did not give us a chance to damn breathe. This is the point in the game they, where you but that's them, though. They score quick. So this is why we got to play that football to slow down the clock then and keep, keep the ball away from them. Damn! <laughs> Damn! Bro, y'all hear that? It sound, like a, it sound like I ran into a fucking brick wall. <laughs> I got lit up. It's second and five here. Ball on the 22 yard line. They try to get off the field so damn fast. They try running left. Ooh, let's go. Yes, sir. Big strong back. Big back, big back. <laughs> I'm not in, so. And the QB is. Like I said, I don't. If I let the CPU take charge, there you go. Let's go. It's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this. What the? It makes an off. Oh no! Oh no! Nah, number 13 must be on that Diddy timing, bruh. Cuz look at him. Bro, what is. Then watch this. Gas up, right? It's still falling. What is, what is 13 on? You know he goes to the Diddy parties, bruh. This camera goes. <laughs> <laughs> no! No! This is out. This 
is insane! <laughs> Hide your baby oil. <laughs> oh, oh. Let me continue on, brother. <laughs> Let me continue on, brother. I didn't just watch my teammate get violated by number thirteen. <laughs> oh man. Damn. He's like, I like you and I want you. Really makes you wonder was there a miscommunication up front by the offense? I spent off dude, but I didn't get nothing. Alright, y'all. The running back didn't have much of a chance at all. We got to have some fun. I didn't even get a goddamn chance to get, get 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 motion and bro. Man's gonna throw that fucking heater. Can a brother can a brother have a chance to? Let's go. My boy Manny. I can't get him free. He's wrapped up for the sack. Here's the eighth play of the series. But this is good for us. We just we just draining the clock right now. We're just draining the clock. That's what we want. I'm open! I'm open! What's that? What's what's that guy up there right at the top of the screen, bro? Y'all see top of the screen right there, bro. What 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 does this QB decide to do, bro? Doesn't doesn't even look at way look at me and takes off the run. KJ KJ <laughs> Telling me to roll on reins. Hold on, y'all. I see goddamn seat bug. Stink bugs be annoying me. Y'all know something about stink bugs, bro? Stink bugs don't really do nothing. Stink bugs are like mosquitoes. If we wiped them out, the ecosystem would not be hurt. Like, if you look it up, it literally shows that stink bugs are really just pests. They're just pests. They don't add value to the ecosystem. F 
them sting bugs, bro. Fuck them. And mosquitoes too. Both of them can go go somewhere. They 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 can just I don't know. I don't know. We need to be like Joe Burrow and Chase. We definitely can. Or actually, 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 you could be Lamar. I be I be I be uh, I be Derrick Henry. But what's up, MTG? Got me paranoid now. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Pulls down the catch and he's got room here. Tackle at the 40. No. Cause Tipsy's the Tipsy's the QB. You wouldn't start. Trying to stop the run here with a goal line. You would you will be back up to Tipsy. Yeah. Around the 38 yard line. Tipsy is the QB over there. That's why would you want to be a QB when you are a receiver with a QB over there? You're the one who uh Oh shoot. Bruh Y'all pray for my QB, bruh. Play, please play. Okay, he throws to Johnson. Let's go. And he's level at the 20 yard line. What a play. Boy, solid job there by the quarterback, recognizing the defensive coverage and delivering the ball to the open receiver. It's first and 10. Oh, shoot. I only, only saw we got us eight seconds left. I didn't even realize that. All right, we'll try, we'll try one last pass play. Yeah, he told me. I got his stuff in my phone. I got him, I got his stuff in on the Discord. Damn! Damn! He got up. That's a great tackle at the 12-yard line, and that's the second interception of the game by this defense. These guys are all over the field. It seems like wherever the quarterback throws the ball, QB got. No, I mean the linebacker got the fuck up. I ain't gonna lie. Down 10 yards to go. All on their own 12. They'll drop him for a loss. We played a half of football. We're even at seven in this one. What do you think is funny? That he wants to be a 6'5 QB? A wide receiver. Hold on, y'all. Yeah! 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 Yeah, because the cap. Sheesh. A seven foot? No. No. I'm not doing no damn seven foot player. You got me tripping. It's already crazy enough having you be 6'9. If he was a seven foot QB, I would make him, he would be slow as possible, bro. I'm not about to do that. Make no seven foot player with a 90 speed. Sheesh. This ain't the NBA. Plus, being that damn big, he wouldn't last that long. Being that damn big, that tall, and real life football. That's. Let's break this down real fast, y'all. Because it was the whole conversation about football versus basketball. A lot of players in the NBA would be considered way too tall for the NFL would be way too tall to play college football. Because the fact of the matter, the average NBA player is six foot or higher. Usually those who are six foot are either wide receivers or linemen. And linemen are always usually around close to maybe 100 pounds heavier than the average six foot point guard. So you throw in players like Joel Embiid, Giannis Antetokounmpo, uh, 
Nikola Jokic, players who are 6'11", 7' foot, bro, in football, they would, their careers would be so shortened. They would, careers would be put, their careers would be shortened so fast because them legs, them fucking legs would take a beating. That's why at least with basketball, you can back down, you know, not really get a hint of your legs. But football, your legs go, you, the taller you are, the lower body is where they're going to go for the most. He said he was going to play some college basketball until he got hit to the hit. Yeah. Like, as much as we love football, like me, football is more would be more for me because of my height versus trying to play basketball. I would be severely undersized these days. Um, and, yeah, trying to play football as a seven-foot player is not it. It might seem fun, but you got to. Got thing logical about the health. Let's go! Look at me celebrating. From their own 46 yard line. First down. And honestly, it's amazing that he's alive and well. Um. Oh yeah! Let's go! Still, you can have tree trunk legs. They don't give a fuck. If you have tree trunk legs, they will still come for your legs. Because you could be seven foot. You could be seven foot with tree trunk legs. But a player like Ray Lewis coming at you, full speed, he going to knock the wind out of you. You got to play like, uh, you got to play like Jamal Lewis, Brian Dawkins. Troy Palamalu, old school Lawrence Taylor, coming at you full speed, don't matter. Them tree truck legs will be cut down to size, or they going for that belly, and that's going to knock the wind out you real fast. That's high school, brother. That's the thing a lot of people don't understand. You can dominate in high school. You can dominate in college. But how many players have truly came to the NFL and dominated? I'll wait. I'll tell you players who dominated in college and dominated in the NFL. But I'll tell you how long their careers lasted. Not that long. Barry Sanders. Career, 10 years. For a running back, that's actually pretty lengthy. But RG3, dominated in college. Won the Heisman and all that. Went to the NFL. Knees gave out. Yeah, but he would be playing basketball. Because with his size, basketball is made for him being 7 foot. It's not made for him being an NFL player. Believe me. If it was, then there would be way more seven foot players playing in the NFL at right now. Because you know how many are? Coming to Cincinnati, what happened, brother? Yeah. What happened? Also, you can't be QB already over there. They already have a QB over there named uh Let's go break that tackle! They already had a QB over there. His name is Steve Merka. They need about three yards to get the first down here on And you would not be starting over Steve Merka. He's a beast. LSU is undefeated. Up 
But then again, like I said, Rex, I, 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 you play this well, and you understand the game as somebody like me as well, who not even just knowledgeable about the game, but not even just knowing, but just knowing the differences between basketball and football. Where like, man, like you know, I'm six seven. I would dominate football easily. No, you would not. No, you would not. Depending on what position. No, you would not. Seven foot QB? No, you would not. Even a seven foot wide receiver? No, you would not. Because they would become. Well, you would be uh, a wide receiver too then because they got M NCAA young boy starting at the wide receiver. Bro, I try to cut back. Third and long, and you know what? Up a punting situation. On third down, the defense was expecting the pass, and they defended the play very well in the secondary. So they're going to go for it here. This is kind of a surprising call right here by the coach. This is an obvious punting situation. Are we going for it? Because why? Why not? Why not? Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness! If we lose because of him. No, I don't want Jack. Cause look at this, bro. Why? He he was so ready to run. You he he didn't even set his feet before trying to take off. But the fact of the matter, the QB didn't even try. This was no play action pass. All right. The thing is, he he'd even he'd even take a second to try to set his feet. But sorry, before before believing the play play broke down. Look at him. And the thing is, he still can throw on the run. Oh my gosh! Bro. How Look at this. Him. Me. Him. Nobody's in Alabama. Nobody's in Alabama. Alabama's open. Last drive short, so I think they're going to be looking for a little more success right here. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. You don't make changes after one play. Yeah! about the 43. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
Get off of me, damn! And he's taken down around the 31 yard line. Okay. Now I'm keeping I'm I'm keeping Jack over at I'm keeping Jack at Notre Dame. Plus our our uh our QB is a senior, so he'll be leaving regardless next this season. I don't want to just have everybody just bounce after one season. You know? Everybody's so quickly to hop in the transfer portal. Like, that's why I'm at least giving two seasons. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Nice run there. Neal gains about five yards on the run. We've got a second and five. Ball on their own 30. it out to maybe the 33 yard line he picked up around three yards on the draw play there's no wide receiver at, with tipsy oh I was Quinn I did not realize I was Quinn yeah, there's there's no wide receiver. It's just tipsy. He the QB over there, but there's no wide receiver over there. But I will tell you this, you go there, you're not transferring again. You only get one transfer, that's it. And so it's another third down upcoming here. I'm not gonna be letting y'all bounce, bounce all over because one season go bad. He gets rid of this one. And they're gonna have to bring on the punt team. It was a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. So I gotta, I gotta, I gotta know, y'all. Am I crazy? Am I crazy to believe that I'm good on a bad team? I'm a good player on a bad team. He steps out at the 31-yard line. So the referee initially calls it a catch, but we'll get a second look at it here and determine if he was inbound when he hauled it in. And that play happened so fast that it was very tough to tell if he was able Bro, to down or not. What? Bro, his feet were a goddamn mile long. Now I'm, I can't do it. Like I said, like like I said, I, I ain't gonna transfer after just one season. Nah, I'm at least give it two seasons. That way, also, if this was real life, then I would get my at least my associate's degree before transferring. But I'm not transferring just yet. I got patience. Oh! I lit that QB up. Damn, I was right there for the interception. Finds his man and they take him down immediately. Damn, 
didn't even have a chance to. Damn! Fuck it. I didn't get a chance to. That would be one year. What you mean one year? It takes two years to get your associate's degree. No, it takes two years to get your associate's degree. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. I don't know what what college that it takes one year to get an associate's degree. Fires that quickly incomplete. A little too much juice on that one. And this quarterback sometimes gets a little That's if you started yeah, if you started high school maybe, but for average regular people it's two years. Second down. Let's go. This is the eighth play of this drive. Houston is up seven. Uh, damn it. Rose. Yes, let's go. I deflected that. Coordinator did a great job with the play call there. Put his defense and alignment in a position to be able to make a play. I don't. I'm not sure how how you get it that fast. Like I said, the only time I ever seen like that happen is if you start in high school early. How many weeks are in the season? Twelve. He gets it up and it's long enough, and he just drilled it from long range. Let's check in with Reese Davis in the studio. We've been keeping an eye on everything going on in the top 25. The Horned Frog strikes through the air, getting into the end zone. For okay, we got to do something. We got to score, y'all. We are down. Look, we down by 10. I'm, I'm not throwing in the towel yet. We are not cooked because we still have a chance. Let's go! No, I'm gonna pull their own. I'm gonna pull their own method on them. Hurry this shit up. No, I'm not doing the hail mary. Oh, let's go! The, oh, the halfback dive. It's been effective right now. They are not stopping me. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. I'm almost at 100 yards, y'all. I'm gonna keep spamming this like it's NFL Street because that's what I be doing. Because the run. Finally caught on. That's all right. That's all right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Watch this. What do you pass? And down he goes at about the forty one. What happened to our blocks? They won't get the first down. Unable to convert. All that effort, bro. What happened to my blocks? We had it good. Down and the ball changes hands. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. I think this coach just took me out really too. Step it up and make it stop. Freak it! I'm a, I'm a just, I'm a just control the whole team then. Quick pass. They'll bring him down around the 47 yard line. Yeah, because I'm not getting back on the field right now. Coach just took me off the field right now. I missed, I 
whiff. That's on me. That's on me. That's on me. I whiff. I whiff. I'm not going to use my timeouts at all yet. I still got time. We've been doing well. Ah, he's trying to go. Ah, man, he should have went up for that. Mm. I'm going to get an interception. That QB is not not been, th been uh, throwing very accurate. Okay, come on, come on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, he posted this say watch the draw down. The 26 yard line, just a simple draw play, there, but he picked up some big yards. It's first and ten. Ball on the twenty-six. I'm gonna start using my timeouts. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth. Come on. Court. Come on. To the right and tackle immediately. The Bearcats taking their first time out of the half. Mm -hmm. Might be early, but the thing is, there's there's no two minute warnings in this game. They're doing hurry up again. Oh, brother. He's going to do a run play. Hey, he watch. Ah, oh, come on! Cincinnati's going to have to use their second time out of the half. That's cooked. This game. Uh, this game. And they scored on us too. The Cougars coaching staff, Kirk, do they start wondering, hey, uh, are we going to have trouble with our star player after the struggles he had today? Well, I think the coaching staff's got to be happy that this team was able to win the football game and overcome the fact that their star player didn't have a great game. But I think making adjustments and changing the game plan because their star didn't deliver, I think that would be a big mistake. There were cases where... I did pick, say, hey, throw it to me, and the QB threw it, and then that was a bad throw. But a lot of times, as we witness, the QB doing some dumb shit, man. I was done. I was so done. Me and other dude was wide open, and the QB didn't even take a second to set his feet before wanting to take off. I need a pocket passer type of QB, bro. I don't need a scrambler. I need a pocket passer type of QB. I do not need a scrambler. I need somebody who, who's not going to even try to run, bro. I need like a Drew Brees. Like, only moves to get, you know, wiggle room, but I don't need I don't need a scrambler QB. It doesn't work well with us. Like, look at him. 11 of 20, 115 yards, one TD. Two interceptions. Four freaking sacks. I blame it on him being from Michigan. He's from Michigan. At that. Playing for an Ohio team. He came in to sabotage this, bro. And he's a red shirt, too. Meaning that 
Coach shot him out for a year to get him better. Clearly, he was wrong. But here I am. 28 attempts, 95 yards. I averaged 3 yards, 3.3 yards a carry, which means I was getting yards, but they was just, you know, chuggling along. You know, I was eating away. I was eating away at them yards. This man kept trying to run. He got negative 6 yards on 6 attempts. His longest was four. What the logic of him trying to run? Receiving six receptions, seventy-two yards, one TD. Defensive. I only had one tackle, I believe. Yep. But that's also because a lot of times, as you saw, when I try to get a tackle, the lineman would get me right there when I'm right there for it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we just saw me get cooked. It's time to move on and get to the rest of these games. All right. Can it get worse for zero and six for the zero and six Bearcats? If we lose, if we lose every game this season, man, 